you've told us so far, Ellen. For the past 13 years, you've been trapped in a nightmare dimension called the Dark Place. Yeah. It's like New York, but it's not New York. And can be reached from the bottom of Cauldron Lake, but it's not really under the lake. And after all this time, you've managed to get out. Yeah, yeah. But so has your evil doppelganger. Mr. Scratch? Or is it the dark presence? Both. It's interchangeable. He's Scratch when he looks like me, but he can change into this other form. And Scratch, the dark presence, wants to rewrite the world in his own image. Which would be in your image, as he looks just like you. And turn the world into a fucking nightmare. During Deerfest, which is scheduled to take place in a couple of days. You got out of the dark place by writing a novel, the pages we've been finding. But your double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality, taking over people, yeah. making them crazy, bringing the dark place to Bright Falls. Yes, fiction coming in contact with the dark place can change reality. The story is coming true, soaking into everything, like, like, like darkness when, it, when night falls. But last time... It... This will be back in 2010. Yes, last time it didn't happen all at once. The story came true bit by bit as it unfolded. And that dark presence was still bound to the lake. I stopped it before it got the ending it wanted. Before it broke free. Based on that, there's still time. Which brings us to your magical light switch. The clicker. Magical doesn't quite cover it. Scratch wants it to bring about his ending. That, that can't happen. If I can get the clicker, I, I can send him back to the dark place. Make all the shit go away. Look, I know it's batshit crazy. My memory is, is full of holes, and I, I'm not sure how much I can trust. It's like, it's, like, it's like a half forgotten dream. Mr. Wake, Alan, we've seen our share of batshit crazy in the past 24 hours. What I want to know is, why am I? Why are we written into the story? I think I saw you, or a vision of you, in the dark place. I think you helped me reach out and escape somehow. With that in the story, Scratch would have edited it to get to you. To hurt you, we are all in danger. All right, guys, it looks like we are ready to get started here. And there's so much of it. Okay, so now we're back to playing Saga again, which is actually pretty interesting. Let's see what else we need to do here, guys. So it looks like there's going to be quite a bit. We do have our gun. We just can't. Oh, we actually have to finish talking to Alan here to find out what's going on. All right, okay. Did a little bit of tweaking just to see how gameplay performance will be good. Well, I guess we'll find out. All right, let's have a word with uh, Alan here. How do you... Hmm? He, doesn't like, he doesn't like... He doesn't like... He doesn't like Alan. Yes. Okay, so the cult has the clicker the whole time. Uh-oh. He could be confused or he could be hiding something. Or that could be Mr. Scratch. For all we know, guys. We have no idea what we are up against here. So it looks like he wants me to do this. The cult and the clicker and Scratch. This Wait, we got to be careful. Cult. Wake is hiding pages. That's how he knows the cult has the clicker. Okay, he's hiding those pages, guys. Wake has a double. Mr. Scratch, where is he now? A cloud of wrath wears my face. The dark place in your place, scratching out my body of work. Scratch is here. In Washington. Oh, no. He's hunting Wake. Yeah, he is. Okay, Scratch and Wake. Let's Scratch find out what's going on with this one. Like don't wake up the dreamer if your life is a dream. I swam to the shore, but the water is rising. Wake and Scratch are clearly connected. Maybe Scratch got out because Wake did. Or vice versa. Right, very true. Okay, so we ended up finishing these up. We need to find out. That's the radio. We don't have to worry about this too much. What is with the manuscripts here? We're just going to grab these just to clear them up, guys. Oh, wait. Oh, we're still in our thinking room. That's what we're doing here right now. All right, so goals. Learn more about the clicker. Oh, we do have some upgrade points, guys. Weapon upgrade. What's this? Oh, we can drink. I didn't even know that Casey's was a thing. Casey's favorite brand. Tastes terrible. Okay, I don't think we've been doing any... Oh, yeah, we did. But we don't have that much. We only have eight. Okay, so yeah, we got ways to go before we can do that, guys. All right, here's profiling. The bookers. That was the beginning of the game. The Nightingale, we know who that is. And then the Wake. All right, we don't have to worry about those right now, but we do have the case board. Okay, where is the heart? Words on the heart. So the heart went missing? 
Am I forgetting what we did in the previous episodes here? Am I lost? All right, let's take a look. They play cards in the general store. The witch had stolen his heart. Get out of my house. He sounds so angry. Wow. They play cards in the general store. Okay, we have the cult the stashes. Get out of my house. Uh, I don't think we're doing anything. Oh, here we go. We're back here. Okay, I had to look for it on the board. I right, find evidence, which we don't. I don't think we've even did. Uh, don't think. Bright Falls area. Yeah, we don't have anything. Okay, hold on. Where do I need to put this? I'm confused, man. Cult of the tree. Okay. See, the cults are definitely very interesting because we don't really know everything about them. At least not yet. Okay, so we're back in the room with Wake and Casey. Let's see why Alan is hiding these pages. Okay. Mr. Wake, I know you have more pages of the manuscript on you. You don't understand how vital these pages are. They're the only way I can know what's coming. You're not the only one trying to solve this. This is our job. Okay, here. This is all I have. Be careful with them. Okay, so Alan's actually giving us some manuscripts here. What are Inside the, the trailer, at the outskirts of Watery, Saga had seen Wake's fabled clicker for the first time. In the hands oh. of the cult of the tree, a cultist stared at her. She drew a weapon. Oh no, we're about to get into something here, guys. So that means it's time to hit the board because now we got something new to do here, guys. Profile, let's go back to the board. Profile someone. Oh, we got ways to go before we get to that. Okay, so if that's the case, then where are we supposed to go then? Wake has more information. I need to keep questioning him. Okay, so we're not done questioning him yet then. Okay, let's see here. We have a clue. Alan Wake's interview. So let's put Wake that. Wake just gave us a lot of information. But yeah, he did. clicker seems like a good place to start. If we find that, then we find the cult. Okay. That, that's, that's definitely a good start. That is a good question. Where is the clicker? Talk to someone. Probably Wake. Okay. Doesn't make sense. The cult of the tree is in possession of the clicker. Weird placement. It kind of tells you where to go, the though. The cult of the tree has the clicker Wake told me about. They're a part of all this. Yeah, they are. So we have to track down a clicker in Watery, and we have to drive to Watery. So this is going to be... This is going to be fun, man! Let's talk it's to Wake again. From now on, you can switch between Alan and Saga's story via the bucket in the janitor's break room. Feel free to play in whatever order you choose. Oh! That is interesting. So we can just play one character all the way through or we can play between both characters. So here's the puddle. And we can switch reality. That is actually pretty interesting. Let's go ahead and continue with Saga. We haven't actually played her in a while. We've been doing a lot of the, the wake missions, guys. So let's see. Oh, wait, we're you not done talking. You wrote these pages in the dark place. So why are we finding them here? I think I wrote them. Up. I remember writing an endless amount of pages. But when this happened before, the, the pages were being sent from the dark place to help me. Maybe the same thing is happening here. Maybe. That's all for now, Mr. Wake. Thank you for your cooperation. All right, we're done talking to Mr. Wake, guys. We're going to head to Watery. It's showtime. Oh, uh, actually, this is the first time we've actually left that room. We never... Have we been out here? I don't remember if we did or not. Okay, this guy is really happy. Oh, uh, Casey's talking to Alan right now. Uh-oh. Look at the what? Hello, and welcome to Coffee World, voted Washington's best coffee-themed amusement park. Okay, so now we're actually able to go back out into Bright Falls and explore a little bit. That's good. We haven't really been exploring that much. I'm sure there's a lot more to this game than what we could find. Uh, we are able to switch characters, which is cool, but I guess we'll find out what mission we're going to be doing. Probably have to get to our vehicle. Cauldron Lake, Watery. Oh, we oh, so we don't get the... Oh, we don't really get the free roam, so it's more of a it just takes us there type of thing. Uh oh, booby we'll mode. Anderson, I didn't want to say this in front of Wake, but are you sure this is a good idea? Assuming we believe the page, I need to check this out. We need to find the cult. Anyone we meet here could be a member. And this scratch guy. The evil doppelganger? It must be true. Or else this guy can't write for shit. <laughs> The quality of his writing aside, if this page turns out to be true like the rest have, this could be a breakthrough. Yeah. 
We might solve this thing before a backup even arrives. Yeah, they're taking their time, so just be careful out there. Meanwhile, I think me and Wake will have a chat. Maybe I can shake something loose. Okay, but remember what happened with the salt shaker. Yeah, yeah, real funny. Oh, the page placement. Okay. I Somewhere. should ask around. All right, so right now we're doing Return 3, Local Girl. All right, we need to figure out what is going on here, guys. We got a bunch of civilians. I don't know what they're doing, but here's an RV here, right? This could work. Hello. Do you have a second? Long time and no see, Miss Anderson. Uh, Tor and Odin are not here. They are uh, old tricksters always sneaking off. Sorry. No, I, I wanted to ask you about something else. Can you point me to any trailers around here? Sure. Watery Lighthouse Trailer Park. Ilmo Koskel owns it. He owns many things in town. And where is Ilmo? I saw Ilmo and his brother at the bridge. Well, what used to be the bridge. Okay. All right. So we got a few. Do well, you we live around one. here? I live in Bright Falls. You've seen me around. I am Mr. Blum. You call me Vladimir. I work at the nursing home. I take care of your old people. We are on day trip, music, sauna, the good times. I bring them here in the bus. The elderly are very important, and it's a very nice bus. Thanks. Hey, how's it going? All right, so I don't think we have to talk to absolutely every single citizen, but let's see what else we got here. We got a boat. Let's see what we got here. We got some ammunition. We got our flashlight around. We're like, we are just illegally just taking things from people's cabinets. Hmm. Okay. Maybe one what of these guys will talk. Your dream job was as a kid. I bet it wasn't dock worker. I don't know oh. about all that. Oh wait, we got a board here. Oh, we can't go into the water. But we do got one boat just sitting right there. Got ourselves a nice little cooler. What do we have? Yeah, you know, instead of drinks and booze, they're keeping ammunition clips inside the coolers. That's pretty cool. Oh wait, what's this? Special? Probably. Oh, we actually can go inside here, but it's locked. All right, we'll probably have to get the key from somebody. Hello. All right, we're going to go ahead and head inside, guys. We're going into the cafe. We're open from 9 to 8. Let's go inside. Wait a minute. That's the janitor. Okay, then. Catchy tune. Okay, so looks like we got a few things here. This is this watery old Nessie. Welcome to the coffee world. And then we got the Moo Fest coming up pretty soon. Got a bunch of names here on the wall. This is probably something... We do have the Lumi Mert there, but on a sticky note. Why on a sticky note? Ah, I see the puddle. Oh no, guys. Oh wait. Rest easy, buddy. So do we have to switch between Alan then? Is that what we're doing here? Oh, we can. Okay, we actually might have something over here. Hold on. Mom's family was from Sweden. I've always imagined it kind of like this. Saunas, lakes. Seems nice. Enjoying the sauna. You bet. The steam is amazing on my creaky old joints. I'm just waiting for Ati to wrap up his show so we can crack open some beers. I've read that taking a sauna is good for preventing dementia. Yeah, and so is beer. Ever heard of the cult of the tree? The half deer, half man monsters? Oh, sure I've heard of them. They're the reason I can't risk taking walks in the forest anymore. If one of them shows up, how am I supposed to get away? I can't run with a bad hip. I'd be killed for sure. I could maybe use my crutches to defend myself. Did you think that'd work? You're the professional. Probably smart just to stay in the sauna for now. Yeah, it definitely will be. All right, so these guys are just hanging on to saunas. Hey, Seva. A sauna doesn't fix what ails ya. You're a goner. They also say silence is golden. So we can't talk to those guys. Let's see what's inside here, guys. Why is it so dark in here? So creepy. We got some more ammunition. Can't open it. The heck? What? Nothing. How dare you? It tricked me. Oh wait, we got a lower shelf here. Hey, why is this so difficult to open? Okay, I guess we're gonna open up the shed. Oh, this is sauna. Okay, so there was nothing in it. Oh, wait a minute. I remember these. Okay, we don't have to do anything with that though. Over here. Uh-oh. Hey, Ilmo. Oh, it's that guy. How did your walk in the woods with Steven go? Another satisfied customer. I just hope he remembers to write a good review on the webpage. Great to see you back in Watery Saga. Everyone in town missed you. 
Super nice to see you again, Saga. They act like they've known me for years. This keeps happening. Yeah, it's weird. They might be part of the cult. Are you familiar with the cult of the tree? Yeah, we always thought it was an urban legend. Kids drawing creepy symbols to scare each other, but uh, now it's gotten pretty damn real, huh? It's terrible what happened. We're all in shock. Well, we're looking into it, hoping to get things back to normal soon. We're all for that. As normal as it ever gets around here. Yeah, true that. You own the trailer park, right? Mind if I take a look inside? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure the owner of the Watery Lighthouse Trailer Park, me, can help you with that. It's good to have our funniest resident back. Resident? I don't understand what you mean. If this is your way of getting out of any outstanding bills, don't worry. They've been handled. Must be hard coming back to where you and your little girl lived. It's like they remember a different reality. Is the horror story messing with their memories? Maybe. So what is Coffee World? You mean you haven't seen our commercials for it? Coffee World is a smooth blend of rides, food, and fun. We even had a real moose until recently. Plus, right next to Coffee World is the workshop of our own Kalevala Knights Motorcycle Club. We're busy building the uh, floats for Deerfest. Don't go mm. peeking, though. You know, we're setting the big reveal for Deerfest. These people are weird. So, your commercials. They're more than commercial saga. Our goal is to both entertain and educate local viewers about the fine products and services we provide. And uh, Yako here really comes alive in front of the camera. Really, fuck off. I'm just there for the free beer. Not sure what the most excuse is. Hey, I'm writer, producer, co-leader. Do yourself a favor and uh, check them all out. I should like to profile on some subjects. I would just to be safe. Let's head back into the profiling world, guys. Especially these guys. These guys are new on our list. And both of them at that. Oh, Elmo thinks the cult is just an urban legend. Mm -hmm. What does he? There are things that go bump in the night. It's all true. It's all true. Some of the alarm, brother. I gather the troops. Brother. Yuck. The shadow of the forest is creeping closer. They don't think it's an urban legend at all. They know. They understand it's dangerous. Okay, and what about what about this trailer? Elmo made it sound like I lived here. Does he really believe that? Life's laughter and love will guide you home. Saga and her daughter. Oh boy. Happy faces raise property value. The family comes first, Ilma. We take care of her trailer while she's gone. She's one of us, Yako. Her spare key is safe and sound. The Koskala brothers have happy memories of me living here. Wow. This must be the story affecting them. I'll play along for now. I need the key to that trailer. Yeah, you do. Let's go check it out. Okay, so we're going to get that key to that trailer. Are we done? We did some profiling. Let's hit that case board. We do have this. That's for later. Okay, that's Blum. The trailer park is a good place to look for a trailer. Keep it simple, Saga. Okay. All right. Good stuff. Back into the real world, guys. All right, let's... Oh, this is a dead end. Look at this Flooding squad. did this. Yeah. What's the point? Definitely, definitely the dark presence, guys. Okay, here we go. We're about to make the switch. Oh man, what the heck? That was a dark presence. Yeah, he did. Okay, that was initiation draft two. So it looks like we got a few things we need to do here, guys. Right. Okay, here's the words of power. We're gonna hang on to that for now. Right? Oh, okay. Looks like we're going to the typewriter, guys. All right, here we go. I would write a new draft of initiation to reach Parliament Tower using another murder site. Scratch was reaching out from the dark place to get Alice. She was out, but still in danger. We're gonna find this Scratch guy. Oh no, not this again. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Our guest tonight is Alan Wake. This time he wanted to do something. I was back, and I had We sing! Him. I knew how this worked now. I could take control, no more surprises. What demons he wrestles with in the dark hours of the night. Together with our house band, the divine old gods of Asgard, we have created something special. The song is called Carol the Dark. It could not be opened on this side. Okay, so then we can switch reality. So that is the whole purpose of those puddles. I can't quick save it though. You can't hit the shoebox.
Oh, we have to do this. Uh oh, here we go. Okay. What the heck is going on here, guys? Oh, they're telling me where to go? <laughs> that is funny. Uh, and we'll follow along what the heck is going on here we got a door can we just go around don't tell me he has a clicker okay my dreams would light up my imagination and you have nightmares night and day yeah but with the clicker i chase those frights away Ooh, so true so See shadow people. Oh no. Wow. Back to the TV. Weird. And the award goes to Alan White. Should we not touch this? Oh, this is part of the story. We're gonna have to take it. All the shadow people. Okay, let's use this ladder to get out of here, guys. Okay, now what? Oh, I see. So we're going this way. The heck? Oh, we're going the wrong way. What? Well, I'm. Wait, what? Oh no, I think we completely missed it. Oh, the stairs are right here. So dark. And we're about to hit the payphone. I have no charges. Oh no. I need to charge some lighting, guys. You're telling me to hold on. There was a flashlight here. I missed it. Okay, we finally got a flashlight guys. Okay. Now we're on to something. Apparently we couldn't do this before, but now we can. Okay, let's get inside. We can't do anything yet. Wait a minute. We're stuck. I don't I don't have anything for the light. Oh wait a minute. Maybe we gotta keep following these arrows, guys. I think we gotta play along with our little game. Oh I see. Okay, so now we go this way. Yes. Another ship there? Oh, this area definitely looks way di different now. Are oh, we gonna have to fight anybody? I don't think so. Okay, good. All right, let's do this, guys. Is this what we need to do? Well, that just that just changed everything. Oh no, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. Luckily, none of those guys would attack us. But I think we just gotta hit this television set, guys. Let's get out of here. Our character's going crazy right now. Oh, okay, so where are we at now? It just opened the door for me. Here we go. These guys are just playing with us. Make way up top. No, we're back to the typewriter, guys. What's over there? What the heck is he doing? Alright, we do have a flare gun, but not much bullets. We're still gonna use the pistol, guys. Just to play it safe, man. Oh, we can't go this way. We gotta take the stairs. Oh! not dying what the heck we're wasting bullets oh no there's different kind of enemies in our fast oh. 
Oh no, not good guys, not good. I had to use the flare. We just keep coming back. Oh, what the heck? Oh, oh. Man, these enemies are a lot harder. I'm over here trying to do the Alan Wake dodge, and uh, yeah, that tactic is not working, guys. Not working at all! What are we looking for here? So I had to use a flare gun on him. The pistol did nothing. It was a waste of bullets. Okay, we took another one down. Problem is, well, that's why they're giving us all this. We don't have a choice. I think they're kind of introducing us to new enemies. Well, in that case, I better check all these and grab everything we can, because we're going to need every single bit of them, guys. Actually... We need to heal ourselves. Let's heal again, just to be safe. The game knew we were gonna get injured. Like, oh, a new enemy type? Yeah, they won't know what to do. All right, we did get a couple flares, though. Can I assign these as a quick slot? I want those to be down. That's battery pack. Flare on ammo. I mean, I guess for now, I'll make up the health for now, right? Oh, no. Here they come. I need to get them bunched up. Get them all here. Come on. Okay, we're still dodging a little bit. No! I need to smack the heck out of me. All right, that's it. You guys are getting on my nerves. No! This guy. I waste too many bullets, man! Too much! Oh no, we got more. We want with me. All right, we're getting on to something, guys. Let's get some more flare gun ammo because we are going to need it. Okay, what are these? Flare gun ammo? Two? One? I wonder what those barrels are doing. Bet you they explode. All right, we're going to head down, guys. Oh no. That yeah, did nothing. Oh, not good. Oh! Not good. Oh, we gotta shoot them in the head. Okay. All right, looks like we're going to the diver's aisle. Oh, here they come. That's for you. I'm probably just gonna take you out. All right, we got most of them. Still one alive? What? Oh, wow, look at the body physics. Wow! All right. Brad doll physics are, uh, I guess they're pretty good in this game. Interesting. It's like real. Can I move the bodies too? No, we can't move the bodies. Uh-oh. All right, let's get out of here. All right, we do have a light. Okay, safe. Yay. We're safe in the light. We can't take the light though. They won't let me take the light. All right, let's book it on out of here. Back to the television. Oh no. So what's going on now? We're back into the room. Oh no. We might have to speak with Mr. Door. Look at his Alan Wake on the wall, guys. We know that's Mr. Scratch. That was pretty good. Did he just compliment it? Oh, it's the whole the whole band's right here. All right, we can't take the exit, guys. It looks like we're kind of stuck just A going to... Oh. Good move. We got. We got to take the. Uh... Oh, we're back to the typewriter again. Herald of Darkness? What's on the floor here? That's so random. Songs end? Okay, so what is the deal with this song? Well, there might be. I think we just gotta take the television set one more time, guys. We're getting close. Uh oh. This is it. This is it. Alright, we're. And I thought this place couldn't get any stranger. Uh oh. It's the janitor guy again, guys. 
Lost in the Champion of life. Well, he's, Catchy, right? he's singing it. The janitor plays a weird role. The end departs. <laughs>